Hey folks, for the second day in a row, the state of Washington got hit with a little earthquake. There was also one just a little bit east of that, a little closer to Yellowstone. There was an official meningococcus outbreak in Oregon, and uh, there was a mass uh, bird die-off in South Dakota that may have been poisoning, though. We had a tornado event yesterday in Texas, and talk about weird weather. We had that cold wave going on in Europe, and apparently there's been like 140 people who have actually died from this cold wave. So it's definitely no joke. Something else that's not a joke, this is the fourth place, um, there we go, uh, in India to have uh, H1N1, or I'm sorry, H5N1 bird flu uh, uh, reported. The flooding continues in Queensland, excuse me, and we do have that blue-green algae in uh, the southern Australia and New Zealand region. A lot of you have seen uh, mercury creeping in here on the Soho shots. Uh, it is uh, going to be conjoining behind the sun you can see it just uh, in another day or so it's going to be directly behind the sun there for those of you uh, who are interested in these things uh, a lot of these alleged alignments the proper term is actually conjunction and opposition as you can see there we actually just had one that we're coming out of with uh, Venus and Mars opposing each other uh, and believe it or not this is about as close as we're going to get to being in between Jupiter and Saturn there uh, we never actually come right between them here but we're we're close there's a pretty good article right here about the pathway to life. I will put this link below, uh, but I wonder if they've seen uh, MR2's work with electricity and water. Many of you know that the sunspot number is down to uh, about 39 right now. It is very quiet, not a whole lot going on right now. Uh, we are in a downturn, but that doesn't mean there's no space weather. That dark looking coronal hole uh, put out a solar wind stream that is uh, beginning to impact us and affect our magnetosphere a little bit. We can tell on uh, just about all the gauges, the GOES magnetometer. Uh, harps flux gate and induction magnetometer and we can even see here on the total electron content that uh, we did have uh, some penetration of charged particles down into the ionosphere as well uh, but other than that folks as you can see uh, looks very very quiet on the sun maybe we got some magnetic filaments to worry about but nothing major be safe folks